Hello students and welcome to another grammar lesson for A-level Spanish. Today we're going to be looking at definite and indefinite articles. Definite articles. These are articles that are used to indicate a noun in a sentence. It's equivalent to using the in, Sp in English. They are el for masculine, la for feminine, los for masculine plural, and las for feminine plural. So whenever we want to use the word the in Spanish, we have to use these depending on the na on the gender of the noun. For example, la mujer. Indefinite articles. These are used to indicate the noun and then also state its quantity. For example, it's equivalent to a or some. They are un for masculine, which is equivalent to a, una for feminine, which is include which is the equivalent to a, unos, which is equivalent to some. And unas for feminine plural, which is the female equivalent of some. For example, unos platanos, meaning some bananas. Seeing as platanos is masculine plural, we have to use unos. Here you have some questions. Have a go at pausing the video and then attempting these so that you'll be ready to check them out whenever you hit play. Here you have the answers. If you did get them all right, congratulations. However, if you did not, be sure to rewind the video or check through it once more so that when you come to the exam, you can be fully confident. You can also revise some more Spanish at www.revisealevel.co.uk. There's far more information on grammar and also tenses, as well as information on a wide range of other subjects. Be sure to check it out if you are revising for your A-levels. Thank you so much for watching, and until then, I will see you next time.